Yes, guys, what's up? And welcome back to another episode of Sarge's Soldiers. And in today's video, it's gonna be same old, same old from the first two. We're gonna be grinding our evolutions, but to start off, we do have some squad battle rewards. I think we got gold something, I don't know. Again, we played a lot of our games on semi-pro to get like the finishing objective done, finishing mastery, assist mastery, all that kind of stuff. So that's why the packs aren't that good. So we have a 7.5K pack um, and a few other decent ones. She's 83, right? She might be 83. But in Future Stars Team 1, we have Rodman and we have that center back um, that would fit the um the rules for this road to glory um rodman's extinct i don't know if she still is as i'm recording this but rodman has been extinct so we'll have to see where um that car is at uh, we're definitely not gonna have enough coins who's that andre silva beautiful um yeah we'll have to see if we have enough coins at some point i, I don't think anytime soon but maybe we maybe next week champs rewards will bless us that's what I'm hoping for. I'm hoping Champs Rewards would just bless us next week. Um, because we desperately need some coins on this account. Smith, ugh, mini 50k pack now. German. Center back. Not a walkout. Sula at least. Please be Nicolas Sula. Come on. It's Mats Hummels. Not what you want to see, man. That is just not what you want to see. Vimmer. Anyone in here we could really use. Not at all. But... Obviously, I have not recorded anything for Future Stars yet, so we haven't even discussed um, the evolutions that we have, because we got those nine attacker evolution cards, and Jesus Ferreira obviously fits the, the role of this RTG perfectly. Um, I'm going to finish Tyler Adams first. We'll get him all done. Um, and then Jesus Ferreira, I mean, it takes, how many games does it take? 21. It takes 21 games to evo him to this 90 rated card, but honestly, like, especially like next week, say we don't get him done during the week. Say next week when we play champs, it's like boom, boom, boom. Like, it's you get it done pretty, pretty simply. And also, I'll have to play rivals this week and probably more squad battles. Um, so, he will get done quicker than we may think. So, that's good. But Tyler Adams. Tyler Adams is like priority because there's only seven days left. I want to get him done. Gabby Sara is probably third priority now. Ferreira is going to be second priority. And then Gabby Sara. Maybe I'll do Fosnock real quick. I might do Fosnock real quick. Um, just because of how easy he is to get the Evo done. So that's probably what we will do. Um, but yeah. And where are we at in Rivals right now? Where are we at? Um... Let's see. So we still need three more wins. Okay, that's perfect. That's perfect. So I'll get those done for probably the last bit of um, Adams. Because so I'll, I'll play these games in squad battles to, to get the clean sheet stuff done. And then this I can do in rivals. That's perfect. That is going to work out very, very, very well for us. Um, but yeah, I'll see you with whatever is next. In today. Guys, we are later in the day now. But... Massive content, absolutely massive content. Well, nothing like insane in terms of packs or anything, but the Future Stars Academy Defenders pack. We've once again been lucky. We've once again been blessed with an American who suits the RTG absolutely perfectly. Tolkien, do I like the Red Bulls? No, but that's all right. This car could be 88 rated. It'll be a great left back for us to have. And then there's no one else here is gonna fit it. But, you know, that's all right. That is perfectly fine. Um, we aren't going to complain about that. But we also have a few packs right here um, from, I think, Daily Play. So if we can see anything half decent here, you know, I'm not going to complain. La Toro Martinez. Avila. That's a, he just went to Betis, I think. I'm pretty sure. Um, I'm like 90% sure he just went to Real Betis. Um, yeah. If he, if he didn't, then I'm going to look like a fool. But 84 plus rated player. Boom. Oh my. Madrid? Oh my god. We just packed a future star. Again, it's just going to be fodder, but we packed a future star out of a 84 plus. I mean, I can't complain with that, man. That's fodder. That is Alex Morgan fodder right there. Or Icon pick. You don't. You never know. I don't know which one I'm going to do yet. Probably Alex Morgan. Um, center goal. Center back. Cool Bali? It is solid. We love that. 84s, bro. We ain't going to complain with that. Joel Linton in there as well. Um, 
Very, very nice. Very, very nice. 81 times 2? Come on. German. Left back. Rouch, right? Dude, the, the knowledge. The knowledge, man. The knowledge, man. Look at that, man. Look at that, man. The knowledge. All right. Last pack. 83-3. No future star. Not going to complain. Danish. CDM. Pierre Emile Hoybier. Um, any American? Anything? Ugh, dude, Cascarino at the start of this game is a super sub. Oh my gosh. My main account was the most OP thing ever. I remember I bring her off the bench every game and she would just score. Like it was, it was genuinely unfair. But the other thing I want to take a look at real quick is that 88 rated Tolkien card. Because obviously that's who we're going to be putting into the uh, defender one. Um, so where's Tolkien? Where is he? Right here. Boom. And how long is this one? Oh, is it the same? Okay, it's a few, I think two less games. Because I think the other one's 21. This one is 12, 8. So that's one less. I mean, for a 88 rated Tolkien, I, I don't know. But you know what? We're not going to complain with that. Like, because Tolkien, honestly, already is our starting left back. That's that's the thing. Um, can that card play anywhere else? I feel like he can Left one back, CDM left. Ooh, that CDM position change could actually suit us well. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll see. We'll see um, what we can do there. But that's very good for RTG, and I'll be back with, once again, whatever. Oh, we yeah. are currently almost finished with Tyler Adams. We just have to play four more games, and then we are done with that card. That's an 89 rated Tyler Adams into the club. Who is going to be absolutely fantastic for the team. It's probably going to be a mainstay in that midfield for a long, long time. But the amount of packs we've been getting from objectives are absolutely amazing. And I, I gotta be honest with you. Like, it it genuinely like astounds me how much you need. You, you need a good keeper in this game. Like, I'm using Angus Gun, right? A 74 rated silver rare. Right. Am I expecting him to be crazy? No. Am I expecting him to like just save shots that are directly at him? Yes, you know, I am. But he can't do that. It's just so annoying, man. And the thing is too, it's the same thing with like the gold keepers. I swear the only good keepers in this game are like, is that Osimhen? Dang it, man. Dang it, bro, I needed that Osimhen. Um, the only really good cards, goalkeepers in this game are icons or like Allison or Ederson like I thought we got an icon for a second but like these icons are levels above in my opinion levels above every other card in this game whether they're gold like whatever inform any special keeper it's just icons are levels ahead in my opinion levels ahead French center mid you meant to set Paul Pogba Rabio. Pulp is a non rare, actually, isn't he? I think I also think he's out of the game. Um, 81 times 2. Boom. Dude, we see some walkouts, man. That's all I'm asking for. Like, not Ruby Costa, man. Or Diego Costa. What am I doing? What, what, what am I doing? What am I talking, bro? I'm talking nonsense. I'm talking absolute nonsense. Um, we have some good fodder packs here, man. EA, come on. Show us the juice. Come on. German Cam, Magul, please. Musiala or Magul, please. Not Muller. Ugh, dude. I swear my main account, I always pack either... I always pack Magul on the main account, where I don't need fodder necessarily, but I just cannot get it on this account. German. Striker. Pop. Schuler. Dub, we take that. 86. W. W. Ooh, that's a good pull for the account. That's Eve, some Evo right there in the future. Timmy Weah, first owner. We take that. We most definitely take that. Not going to complain there. Obviously, he has his radioactive right back card, but um, maybe we could Evo that 74 card into something better at some point. You never know. Um, Cam, Spanish, Levante. I don't think that's anything too special. Yeah, it's not. It's an 82. Um, let's see. 84 plus. We got a future stars out of this before. Not this time, though. Spanish. Left wing back, Grimaldo. 
Uh, I think we have them actually. We do, and I'm, I'm just gonna discard them. I know on an RTG, that's probably gonna annoy a lot of you, but I, I don't, I don't even know anymore, man. I don't even know. A three three, please. Fodder, 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 fodder. Is that Marco Asensio, man? Three eighty threes. <sighs> Jordi Alba duplicates. Come on, EA man, show us something, man. Show us something. Inform. That's clutch, actually. Croatian inform center mid. Is that Meyer? Yep. 85. And then Chris Smalling in that pack as well. Solid. Solid, solid, solid. Let's go again. Oh, Jesus. Let's go ahead and get Tyler Adams. Though. All righty, ladies and gentlemen, to end off this episode of Sergeant's Soldiers, we are going to be claiming the 89 rated Tyler Adams. An absolutely fantastic card. It's probably going to be around for a while in this squad. Can play DM, can play right back, maybe even center back if we need a center back desperately. He's a card who we can play in game, a lot of different positions, and that is very, very nice to have. And then also to end it off, we have as well two packs right here 25k pack and then an 83 times three. Osim Hen this time? There we go. We got Lookman the first time. We get Osim Hen this time. 88 rated fodder. That is absolutely fantastic. I'll probably have to go ahead and look at how close we are to completing um, the Icon Pick SBC. I'm really um, interested in seeing how close we are now. German. Striker. Is that Schuler again? That's a dupe. So, I mean, she might have to go into the Icon. Jan Summer in there as well. Schuler and Jordi Alba. That's not bad. That's not bad. But yeah, if you guys did enjoy today's episode of Sergeant Soldiers, make sure to leave a like, comment, all that kind of good stuff. And I'll catch you in the next one very soon. Peace.